What you doing? You washing the cars? Yeah, bro. This is shiny. These wheels, though. <laughs> Not funny. <laughs> what? They don't look bad, man. They're not bad. They're just, they're okay. They're okay. Yeah, I know the trick. You have, you can't wash the car in the sun. That's what leaves those like, those marks. Of course. If you guys follow me on Facebook, then you already know that I got a new wheel set up for the Supra. You guys can uh, check this out. Voila, so I went with Weld Racing, um, wheels in the back, and then welds also up in the front. Um, I decided to try out a new tire, which these are the Race Masters, um, size is 27, or 255, 50, 17s. They actually sit in a little bit more than what I than what I like, so I actually ordered the spacers for these. Um, I think I'm pushing, I think the site recommended it to do 15 in the rear, if I recall, and then uh, 12 millimeter up in the front. So um, the kit actually comes with extended studs, not studs, but bolts. Um, so hopefully I get those in possibly tomorrow if I made cutoff time. Uh, maybe Friday who knows but these wheels look really really badass if you guys can see and then the front or I don't know why I said wheels I mean welds um, same tire M&H 185 55 17s and it came out pretty good so I used to have Sorry, my garage is a little dirty, so don't mind it. I used to have these on the back, which are really, really, really good. The problem was, is that while running these tires with the factory stock wheels, I was um, about over 100 miles an hour. You start to get a little fishy, like you're swimming out there. Like it was, getting kind of, not, un, uh, kind of unsafe. It was just way, way too much. Um, so even though I like these, I really wanted to get a, a nice looking wheel set for the Supra. Um, so now, tomorrow, I also have, I also have a turbo kit um, that I'm picking up tomorrow. I think it's the Odyssey Fab top mount turbo kit for this with a 62-62. Um, not to push too much power, but it's gonna be a top mount, so it's gonna look really badass. It's gonna sound nice with external wastegates. Um, the plan for the car right now is keep the stock seats, keep the stock exhaust system, just have the external wastegates, so that way I don't have too loud cars, because this is pretty loud also, but having that, um, pretty much my daily driver. Yeah, I don't want it super duper loud unless I get on it, which which was the reason why I wanted to get an external wastegate kit. That way when I got on it, that's the only time it gets loud. So I have that turbo kit coming up tomorrow. So hopefully we'll get, hopefully I have all the parts because I still have to fab up the oil lines and all that, but I still have all these parts chilling right here. The nitrous bottle, the heater, um, the meth kit, is literally all in here. Also, the Titan Motorsports meth kit, um, the window switches in here. So I had to order some fittings for that also. So hopefully those get all in here tomorrow. Just check and see. I just wanted to give you guys an update on the progress for the car. But yeah, today all I did was get the wheels mounted and all that. I haven't got it aligned just yet because I knew I was gonna throw the spacers on. And to be honest, I don't know if spacers throw off an alignment or not, but, and I wasn't, honestly, I wasn't sure if I was gonna put lowering springs or coilovers on it yet. I might just keep it stock height just for now. Might put coilovers on it, possibly. Who knows, you know? Car's doing, doing good, it looks great. Looks great, can't complain. Definitely like the color scheme, definitely like this red. And um, the goal, the goal is just to have pretty much stock seats, stock 
stock weight if possible because I know the wheel, the, the welds kind of dump some of that weight off also. So I'm going to keep the stock exhaust, stock interior, um, nothing yeah. touched in there. And we'll see what it does. So hope you guys enjoyed this little update video. I know it's not super, super long or not really action. I just wanted to show you guys an update. So if you guys have any questions, just post down below. If you are new to the channel, then press that subscribe button and I'll check you guys out tomorrow to keep you guys with the update on the turbo kit and whatever else I get in the mail, which is a surprise for y'all. So peace out.